Global Newsroom in Toronto. News Hour with Leslie Roberts and Anne Ruskowski. And thank you all for joining us on this Monday. We begin tonight with the reunion between a man and his missing pets. But this isn't your average missing dog or cat story. There are two exotic snakes. And what's incredible is they disappeared weeks apart but showed up at the same place. Our Laura Zilke has our story. Maybe there was a love connection yeah. that kept them together. Because when these two ball then, pythons surfaced in the East York home of Chris Ford and Janet Wilkinson, there was not a lot of love being shared between human and reptile. We actually left the house on Friday night when we found the second one. The second snake surfaced when Janet was doing laundry on Friday. It was coiled up inside the couple's washing machine. The first one had appeared weeks before when Chris was renovating a bathroom. It went back under cover only to slither out again in the basement. Then they were finally able to capture it and bring it to Tail's pet shop in the beach. The fear, there could be more snakes in the house. Today, there is relief. I was just surprised that they're alive because they've been missing since the beginning of July. Now that I'm actually holding these two snakes in my hand again, in my arms, it's just more than, like I said, more than I could ask for. It's just amazing. What's even more incredible about this journey is that the snakes escaped two weeks apart. And they ended up in the same place two weeks after. He, could, he had a huge head start on her. He is Steve French, named after an animal on a TV show. She is Vira. They escaped from a makeshift enclosure where Jacob Lance lived until a few weeks ago, just a few doors down from Janet and Chris. She probably followed his scent, most likely, but... What happened between July and when the pythons were found is really only a story the reptiles themselves know. What Janet and Chris are happy to know, their snake finding days are over. Each shock is worse than the next. It doesn't get easier. Where is he trying to go? He's trying to go, go down my neck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's got your glasses. <laughs> Vira and Steve French also have a new home, a terrarium courtesy of Janet, Chris, and the folks at Tails Pet Shop. And this time, there's a lock. <laughs> That's the end of this story for real this time. <laughs> Laura Zilke, News.